Hello everyone, it's me Ellie from Xexpress Themes and this is the video tutorial for Blogger Theme where I'm going to be showing you how you can upload slider uh, images on slider section. So as you can see, this is the demo site for Blogger Theme and here you will find just below menu slider section with the slider beautiful slider images with title and everything. So I'm going to be showing you how you can do this exactly on your site as well. So you need to log into your WordPress account. Then first thing you need to do is you need to make a post category as it shows uh, the slider section shows slider category. So you need to go to post and then click on categories. Then you need to make a new category. I'm going to make slider as my new category and click on this button. Then a slider category will appear just here. You need to click on it to add your post on the slider category. So let me tell you, each image that you are seeing is a single post. So for this, we need to make uh, uh, the number of posts depend on how many images you want uh, in your slider section. So let us make a first post for a slider category. Click on Add New. Then you need to put a title. This title will appear here. Like for example, here we have travel. So if I put this will be our title. And you can also put a description here, which will appear as a caption. Like for here it is a travel is to live. So let us put the same. So you can also give it some formatting. I'm going to bold it a little bit. And then make sure to check the category that you have made for this post. Then set a feature image. So I'm going to be selecting this one. And the best image size is 1024 by 438 pixel. And set it as a feature image. Now this is the slider image that will appear on slider section. Now we need to publish this post. Alright, it is your first post for slider category is published. Now since you want your slider section to slide the images, let us add uh, some more post in this category. Click on add new. Now let me put the title maybe hiking and such and any caption let me get uh, some sample from here okay the place I okay I think this one I like the most the place I did rather be hiking so let me put that please all right so let me make it a little bold and set a feature image as we did in our earlier post. Okay, so let me get this one. Set it as a feature image. Now make sure to check the category and publish this post. Okay, now that we have made two posts under slider category, we are ready to process with our further process. So now go to appearance and then click on customize. Since it is a customized based theme, you won't have theme option here. All the settings of the site has to be done from customize. All right, in customize, you will find this home page setting. Click on it. Then you will get slider settings. You need to enable this section in order to show on the home page. So I have enabled this section. And uh, you need to select the category that you have created. And click on save and publish. Now you can also see on the preview side how our slider section is appearing. That is with the title and the caption and everything. So let me also show you on the front end. All 
All right, now this is the front end of our site and your slider section will appear as such. It's really pretty as how it is appearing. So you can just slide your slider section just by clicking and dragging here like that. It's pretty cool. So I hope this video is helpful to you in uploading, uh, in sorry, configuring slider section as in our demo site. And if you have any confusion, then you can always check the documentation where we have it in home page setting, the slider settings you can see, and you can find all the process here whenever you feel confused about it. Or you can comment down below if you find it difficult or anything confusing, we will try to reply to you as soon as possible. Or you can talk to our support team, you will find details on the footer of our website here. So thank you very much uh, everyone for checking this video and if you like our video tutorials then please subscribe to our channel. Thank you very much. Take care.